Oh, I was falling asleep. It's such a relaxing area. Yee! Hello, everyone, and welcome back to the walkthrough. And I was looking over the footage, and this isn't as big as I thought it was. It's just got these two sticks in the middle here, and then there's these two by three by one sides on each. So it's like two separate puzzles, basically. Oh, and I was thinking about the whole, um, you know, the. The, the coloration of these, like, you know, so these are the gray ones and there's black ones. The black ones seem to open doors, while the uh, gray ones, I haven't been able to figure out yet. Like, the, the black ones seem to open nearby doors, is what I mean, is that... You, you'll notice that, remember those two that were across the Grand Canyon? Well, the thing about that was, there was a certain thing where you couldn't tell which door they actually open until you got down there but I'm pretty sure that when you beat one of the puzzles it unlocked one of those doors to the elevator because there's two doors that that led to it and whatnot so what I presume is that when you get all these gray ones done there's gonna be some sort of signal that'll indicate that yes you have gotten everything set up or whatever for a final ultimate puzzle of sorts maybe I don't know <laughs> it's just the theory but I don't know if it's actually gonna come true but yes um you know you know I think this actually has to be because like this one can't point that way because that's a that's an edge like a corner one I'm not really doing this logically am I so I should be looking through this a little a little more carefully I think um, what I'm thinking, though, is if I rerouted, yeah, like that, and then I took those around, well, uh, yeah, thusly, I think they're all linked now. See, little, little, little thinking goes a long way, <laughs> but I just wanna, just wanna make sure I've got this right here, um, Let's just see here. Those link around, and that one goes to that one. That, oh, no, no, not that one. Dang it. Um, wait, wait. This might be as simple as that. And then, actually, I don't know. Because <laughs> there, yeah, there's this sort of kind of dealio that doesn't quite match up with the rest. Hmm. Hmm? This is gonna be a tricky one. Maybe I'll work on that in a minute. <laughs> let's, let's work on that with a fresher mind and then just focus on this one here first. Obviously this one's a corner. So I, I don't know which way this one goes, but yeah. This one's gotta be flipped to something. And... You know, obviously it's not gonna be parallel. It's, it's gonna be that way or it's gonna be this way, so... <laughs> uh, I wonder if it's just... Oh, that's right, there's also the, the matter of getting the sticks to line up on the tops as well. Oh, I wasn't really thinking about those. I was only thinking about the bottom sticks for some reason. Well, maybe it's as simple as this then. Because taking that around, yeah, it lets it zigzag thusly. And, wait, no, 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 it's still not quite matching up. Uh, <laughs> Hmm. And wait, how did I get that one like... Oh, I'm stupid. <laughs> that was the corner one. Mm-hmm. Can I, like, do that? Yeah. I think. Da-da-da-da-da. Uh-huh. Drops around and... Up and... Okay, actually, that one looks correct now. Okay. So, now for this one. <laughs> now for this one. Doesn't mean... Because I say I'm ready for it, that I'm actually ready for it. Um, I wonder if it's like an, an opposite version of that. Uh, oh no, it's not, because there's there isn't this uh, T Tetris piece over there. Uh, well, let's just see what I can do here. That's gotta connect to there. Then I get, well, no, I actually kind of route this around. That one connects down. I can make that go up, and then I can make this go around, and then like that. Yeah! Wait, that, did that have a different sound than the other ones? 
Hmm. 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 I don't know, but there is your solution. Take note of it. Because now I'm going to go back down the stairs. <laughs> I'm, I'm going to see if there's anything else around the stairway. Because, you know, we looked around here to see if there was other stuff. So I thought maybe I would just pop down here rather than just jump off the top. As much, as, as much fun as jumping off the top would be, I feel that I might be missing something. Like, maybe this here. Like, look at this around this way. <laughs> I don't know if this is going to lead to anything, but it actually might be leading to something. Look at this. I just don't want to fall, because that would be sucky. Uh, well, I can jump on there, but... <laughs> that's that's the stairway that I took up here. And that was... It was a left path of dead end. I think it was a dead end. But yeah, I don't, I don't see any way that... I mean, I don't see any usefulness of jumping down to there. Unless it goes around the, the corner in some significant fashion, no. Okay, so I'd be better off just jumping down to these and then starting my search over on this other side of the stairs that I uh, neglected before. I think, yeah, it just leads around the stairway to, uh, uh... Like, this is all the way back down to the secret path. Yeah, it just kind of loops around. So, okay, it looks like that I've got this cleared out then, so I guess I'm going to keep going along this path and uh, search for secrets, I suppose. There's the whole elevator, by the way, if you didn't notice that before. Yeah. <laughs> when things don't seem to fit together, start by playing with the bigger pieces. i never seen that before when I went through here, so maybe this area is something that I haven't really thoroughly explored before. Uh... You know, the one that's just after the place with the stairs and whatnot. Uh, I've been searching around here, and I haven't really found anything, but that doesn't necessarily mean there isn't something. Like, maybe I'm supposed to jump down to something from some other angle or whatnot. Who knows? Who knows? <laughs> I'm just kind of going around the perimeter here. That's the spot that I jumped down from, you know, the one of the points of no returns. But, uh, yeah, it's not really not really showing up as anything special over here, but I just thought I would show that sign. Hey, look at this. This is on the, the left path of the Grand Canyon. Straight across from that, I'm dropping down here! Should I have done that? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Um. <laughs> I can't see much. <laughs> Unless I'm just trapped in here. I don't know, it's hard to tell. I'm just kind of going in circles here, I think. Uh-oh. Uh yeah, I think I think I trapped myself here. Uh-oh. <laughs> okay, resuming from the last save. Oh, since I did that, I guess I can do this. woo hoo, -hoo! Oh, I, oh, I think I missed the main platform that I was going for. Well, well, <laughs> at least I got the jump down from it. I kind of wonder, is this, like, if this was a glitch or something that happened over here? Because... Why would this be here... Otherwise? I, just, <laughs> I mean, it, it is definitely here, but... It doesn't appear to be any sort of path. I mean, like, imagine if you saved your game in there. That would be a... Game-ending bug, because you'd be stuck in there for all of eternity. <laughs> What is... I can't read the... Oh, wait, there we go. Don't stop believing. <laughs> this was found on the, uh... Um, stairway path around the Grand Canyon. Like, remember there was stairs on the left path that led up to... Uh, here, yeah, I'll show you here really quick. Um, just go... Down and see, there's that. Yeah, those stairs, those led up to the spot that I was looking to, and then I just kind of, I just kind of looked around the corner, and then I seen a sign I couldn't read in this particular game screen resolution, or maybe the the signboard is at a low resolution. <laughs> and yeah, I just I plopped on over here, and then yeah, down over here is the signboard. I'm just looking around the area to see if there's any sort of secret puzzles up here because. Well, this is a kind of out-of-a-way spot, so I thought maybe 
it's it, it'll be something at least perhaps I'm just kind of feeling around the walls here uh, like is there any secret pathways if I jump down to specific spots or went around I don't know yeah, let's try here and look in no I guess not uh, poopers you know, sometimes I gotta wonder where these light sources are coming from in these underground tunnels of sorts. <laughs> and this is, by the way, this is the Grand Canyon Tunnel, uh, just after dropping down. I know I've still got the the room with the elevator to look into, you know, because I didn't really scour that room very thoroughly, but I'm just kind of going through the other ones first, because maybe something different is going to happen over at the elevator room once I get everything finished in these spots you know like the outer spots because maybe the another thing that I got a theory on is the, all those gray puzzles will actually lead to say a different ending or maybe a different outcome once you get to or back to the elevator or whatever so m maybe it's it's not a guaranteed thing or anything like that but I'm just leaving it for last uh, just in case because it's also the last area that's that I've got to plop through for the most part but yeah just a matter of searching through everything one last time I guess and hope that I find everything because I don't even know if there's a guide for this game out, <laughs> out there <laughs> Like, I, I'm not even sure if I could cheat if I wanted to. <laughs> Back to the start! I finished that pathway, I guess. Uh, and I, I guess now I'm gonna go down through the right pathway once more. Uh, because then that'll eventually lead me back to the uh, Slender Cube, which, for all I know, might have changed after I did that last gray puzzle, too. That, that's another possibility. And uh, there's also, it'll also lead me to the elevator as well, so yeah, let's just give this side a rundown and we'll see what I find. Whoa, 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 what the heck? Remember this puzzle over here? Yeah, the L puzzle type, well not L puzzle, the, uh, well yeah it is L type puzzle here, yeah, this one right here. Going back into this darkness area, I don't know if this was here before. Because I'm pretty sure I was searching stuff pretty thoroughly around here, but there's this what appears to be a very dark staircase. Let's go up here and see what is over here. Because, uh, yeah, all this overlooks the. Can I jump down to stuff over here? Just just for the, for the heck of it, see if we're, this actually leads to something good. Uh oh, I didn't mean to fall. Well, I don't think there's anything there anyway, but okay. <laughs> But yeah, I, I didn't notice the staircase before because it, it's so dark and it just blends right in, but I kind of seen it it's like sort of a... I thought it was a corner of a wall or something like that, but it's it's actually a, a staircase and it's it's probably hard for you to see, but it's leading me down to the left and then back down some more stairs. I don't know where it's taking me to, but uh-oh! Uh-oh! <laughs> It looks like I found another puzzle! And interestingly, uh, there, it, there appears to be like a, a different pathway through the same thing then. But this is... this thing is huge. I think I, I, think I might want to come back to this one a little bit later, because I think this one is going to take me forever. So I, I'll take note of that and uh, come back to that, say, in the next part, and just continue on my trek uh, back through looking for stuff. I wonder if that's where the other pathway is going to lead to, you know, the one that I found, the alternate. Yeah, because this is just after the, the other doorways for, that the other ones flopped me through, so... Hmm... Maybe. Ah! I'm back at the Slender Cube thing, and it's gone! Okay, that last gray puzzle definitely did something, but I don't know what it did. Um... So that must mean that I found all the gray puzzles then, right? 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 There will always, there always be more than whatever meets the eye. 
Am I supposed to now click on the spot where it was? I don't know, but there's definitely, definitely something that's different now that I completed that last gray puzzle. Oh, that, this is getting very intriguing with this thing, like even more than it was before. Like I thought it would just be something like a platform where come out of the ground that I jump on it, collect that thing, and then I get a different ending or, or something like that, but it, maybe it's been relocated to somewhere and it's not there anymore. I don't know, but it's definitely, it's just gone. So I, I don't know, I'm gonna have to take a peek see around and maybe see if it relocated or maybe it's down that hole no <laughs> you know the hole that was on the other side of uh, the Grand Canyon here you know that, that I got stuck in like I think it was right over there where, that I, where my pointer is but yeah I, I don't think I mean I was thinking that I was gonna be able to collect it but I, I don't think there's anything actually with that hole over there um, I just don't know what else there could be though other than uh, just to research the spots before that jump 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 sh staircase type jumper staircase thing because uh, I'm pretty sure I did a good amount of searching here and I only found that one puzzle and then I still got the uh, elevator and the of the game right here, if, if you can even call it an ending at this point, which is past this point of no return though, so I'm not gonna... <laughs> of course. Um, oh wait, I just wanna see, wasn't this the one that said it doesn't matter? Yeah, as long as you solve them all. Yeah, I don't know about that other puzzle though, like, if, like, is it just gonna lead me to a secondary puzzle, or is it gonna lead me to another path with a gray puzzle, or is it gonna lead me to another spot with that uh, slender cube who knows who knows <laughs> all I know is I'm gonna go back to the beginning and begin my search on the left route again okay here's the one that's on the right I'm going over to the one on the left now why I'm I'd like to research that is because before that point you know the before the point that I solved that uh, third gray puzzle is that because that slender cube disappeared perhaps something appeared in the area that I searched before this happened basically you know that, that I glanced over because the other spots I've already searched today on this particular part uh, the only ones that I haven't searched were on this left side type place and then um, a little bit up further until we get up to that staircase area and then I'm gonna have to come back over and uh, get myself set up to uh, that larger I should say that super large puzzle for the next part but yeah this part mainly is me just <laughs> searching and speculating over things you know just the stuff that I find stuff that I'm thinking about and I think that's what this game does best is it keeps you wondering what the poop is going on <laughs> I mean, yeah, it did say on the the download page, basically, that, it, you know, you're, you're kept in the dark as to how things work and whatnot, and you're just supposed to figure out everything on your own, and in this case, for this sort of game, it, you know, it just it just works, and we've already been down here before, but I'm, I'm just checking it over anyway, of course, but yeah, in, in the way that this is just set up, it's just such a mysterious, intriguing game that just kind of, just can't help with the keep driving you to go forward and keep searching through stuff. Speaking of, I'm gonna cut forward. <laughs> oh, and not that this game doesn't do puzzles well, because it most certainly does. It's just that uh, without the whole overworld aspect, you know, if if it was going from just like 3D puzzle room to 3D puzzle room, like I, I said before that it could have done, it wouldn't have this whole type of ambience and exploration and mystique element to it that it just happens to have because it has I mean it doesn't just happen to have it it has it because he was created to be as such and yeah <laughs> and I do have to wonder though if there really is something about this drop off into seemingly nothingness it didn't appear to be but I don't know I just feel like I'm gonna 
end up checking that at the very end after I do all the puzzles or something like that, and yeah. Because <laughs> who knows, maybe that's going to be like, it's uh, Slender Cube is going to be down there to teleport you to the final, ultimate, quadruple layer puzzle or something like that, I don't know. <laughs> I guess we'll see. Seriously, where are these light sources coming from? There aren't even any of those sparkly white lights in here to, you know, light up. Oh, there's one there. That So that one, that, that kind of makes sense. But once it disappears through the wall, yeah, it's done. <laughs> I even decided to come back over to gray puzzle number two that I found here. You know, just to see if there's anything that's changed in this area. Because it's just, it's just really wide open ambient type area, but I'm not really seeing anything different over here either. And believe me, I've, I've been very thorough. I've been showing you everything that I found. I've re-walked through all the different paths multiple times here and went along the corners and walls and wedged myself in there as best I could to see if there is something there. And I just noticed this platform in the middle here is Looks like, isn't it floating a little bit? Or is that just the lighting? Uh, I think it's just the lighting that makes it look like it's floating. I mean, obviously I wouldn't be able to go under it or anything like that, but I just I just noticed that. But, oh no, maybe, maybe it is the... No, no, it, it is the way that the lighting is in the game. See how it's got those little... Uh, the, like the blur marks, it blurs out from a certain point rather than it just blurring out radially in a way. So it, it just kind of ends up being like crisscrosses and that kind of throws off my perspective. <laughs> okay, I'm starting here just to give you another perspective on, as to how I got over to the stairs and whatnot. So I'm gonna go show you around here. Like, remember this pathway led to that puzzle there? Well, if you look very closely on this side right there, there's this stairway. Yeah, and you can just hop your way up to the top just by kind of rhythmically mashing the space bar and then moving down to the left going down these stairs and then that leads to this puzzle of which I'm going to do and explore this room I guess in the next part so I hope you enjoyed and I will see you then this one looks like it could take me all day <laughs>